Hey guys, and welcome to a therapist task guide, healthcare privacy part two. For this task, you're gonna to need to search the room in the health resort for any documents about the Terra Group's research, and then you're gonna to need to hand over the received information to the therapist, but you also need to survive an extra shoreline. Don't forget to leave a like on this video if you find this guide useful. So for this task, you are going to need to get the health resort West Wing room 306 key. Now this key is kind of a bit of a hard one to get. You can actually obtain it later on through completing private clinic, which is after this task. So if you are to buy it from the flea market, you will get one later on that is found in raid that you can sell it back onto the flea market. So I'd actually recommend buying it directly from the flea market. But if you do want to try and find it, it does spawn in jackets as well as in the pockets and bags of scavs. And it does actually have a spawn on factory. If you'd like to see the full key guide, that will be up in the iCard at the top right hand corner, as well as in the top link in the description. But like I said, I would recommend that you actually just buy the key from the flea market, as currently key spawns, in my opinion, are rarer than finding killer. On the map in front of you is showing you shoreline and we are up here at the resort just like so on the right there is east wing on the left is west wing and here is the helicopter what we're going to want to do is go to this room directly there so we're going to go through the main entrance which is the west wing we're going to go to the right head through the open area and then follow it around to the right and we're going to go all the way up into the top floor there's only two stairs you can enter for this area so if you go down the far end side where there's a hole in the wall it's actually blocked off and there's no way through what you're going to do is turn to your right and then we're going to continue in that way i'm just going to show you the other set of stairs just like so and there is the admin building but what we're going to do is pass the hole in the floor and we're going to go to 306 which is the first door on the right hand side when unlocking this door the item is directly in front of you just next to the dead scav on the windowsill once you've collected the item, you do need to survive an extra. So if you happen to die once you've collected the item, you do need to come back into raid and collect the item again and survive an extra. Don't forget that actually surprisingly a lot of the time this room is actually unlocked when it is quite later on into the raid. So there are a few different ways you can literally just sit around until there's 10 minutes left. Come here, grab your item and then dip. Or if you need some help actually unlocking this door, you can always head over to our discord discord.gg slash piranha underscore to look for some help with the helpline or in the looking for group section if you are struggling with this task or just in general wanting to find people to play with head over to piranha.tv slash discord we do have a decently large looking for group community as well as a sherpa system so if you just need a bit more help than normal then we are there to help you Hopefully you guys found this guide useful. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe or possibly consider joining the channel membership where you can unlock early videos as well as a few custom rewards. Don't forget to check out Piranha.tv as well. That's a one-stop shop for all of your guides, tasks, keys, all those kind of things in one location. Hopefully you guys found this guide useful and I'll see you in the next video. And a big thank you to all of my Patreons supporting me over on patreon.com slash piranha TV. And a huge thank you to Jay Dam, Freddy, and Beansy. Without this kind of support, I wouldn't be able to do what I do.